Hey guys, Kenny here. Um, so I didn't feel like actually getting ready because I have work later, so I'm not gonna get ready twice today. But that's besides the point, so don't mind the bare face, but I'm gonna give you guys a haul of what I have so far as far as Christmas room decor goes and gift wrapping and all that stuff. And yeah, this year, this thing for this year is going to be completely different. And honestly, I don't think I've ever seen anything like this. I could be wrong though. But everything I have um, is from Target and I will link it down below if I can. I'm gonna link it down below and yeah. Anyways, we're gonna get to this haul right now. Starting off with my grip. Starting off with my gift wrapping, here's my wrapping paper. This is the brand, basic Target brand. They they do this, okay? They do this and they literally ate this year. All of my gift pack wrapping and packaging and stuff is from the same collection, so that's why it all matches really goodly. But here it is. It's just so much like trees on it, cute or whatever. I feel like I probably could have got away with just one just because I also have gift bags, so I don't have to put everything in these boxes. And also these were $5.50 a piece, so 11 freaking dollars on these and it does have the grids in it so that way it's easier to cut and you know measure it that way it looks good whenever you're folding it and stuff so yeah next thing i got is like boring but it's super practical i got these garment gift boxes because my sister wanted like clothes and shoes for christmas so i got her these now this was three for three dollars i'm not even sure this is going to be enough so i may have to buy like another pack i'm not sure i want to wait and see but I don't know. Next up, I have this tissue paper. Super cute. Clearly, it matches my theme. I do not remember how much this tissue paper was, and it doesn't even have the price on it. So, I'll just have to insert it. This for my gift bags. This is my favorite part. I'm going to go smallest by biggest. I have this cute little bag right here. This one, I pretty much already know what I'm using in all of my gift bags. So, I don't remember how much this was. Now, don't get me wrong. These gift bags were, like, overpriced. But I have this one. It's super cute with the gold. It's a little bit of pink on it, a little different. I have this one right here, it's a little bit bigger. Um, I will insert the prices just because obviously they're not on here, but I got this one super cute. Next, I have this one, which is actually my favorite. Now, the problem is, I don't know what I'm going to be putting in this one, but it just has all the cute trees on it and it matches the wrapping paper like so nicely. So I feel like it's going to make my tree pop more. This is actually really cute. Lastly, I have this one right here, which I know it's going in this one also. But um, it's just like this simple, I don't even know what these are supposed to be. And then here's the bag. Now, for the price of these, um, since they are overpriced, you would think that the bag would also be like shiny, but whatever, whatever. Here it is, it's so shiny. All right, so now I'm going to get to like the bigger decor items, which I don't have much. I only have like four decor items, but honestly, as you can see, my room is pretty minimal and I plan on keeping it that way even through Christmas. I'm going to show you guys what I got and you guys will be able to see my theme a lot more, so yeah. First off, starting off with this cute freaking tree, bro. It's like a knit like sweater material and I'm actually really obsessed with it. It's so nice and squishy. Um, This was $10 and I think it's worth every dollar. I think it's super cute, super green. I'm going for a very green vibe this year, as you can probably see by my gift paper, so I love this so much. My next thing is probably like one of my most favorite things in this whole haul is this cute gnome dude. Look at him, he's chocolate just like me. Has a cute little bell. I've never really been a gnome girl. Here he is, I mean, obviously he's like the little knit hat detailing and all that good stuff. So I'm super excited to use this. Not sure where none of this is going yet, but I'm gonna find a place somewhere. Next, I just have these trees right here, and I'm pretty sure these are called bottle trees, but I'm not 100% sure. And I don't even remember how much this was. The last gnome dude I showed you guys, he was $10. Oh, these are actually $5. $5 for two of them, which I'm guessing is a good deal. I don't know, because I don't usually buy stuff like this, but one pink, one more red, one just a little bit more pink, which is kind of weird because I don't have any other pink going on. So I may have to like do more pink, I'm not sure. But anyways, super freaking cute. And then lastly for my decorative items, I have this like, what are these called again? A nutcracker. I have this nutcracker right here, except this thing is like false. It doesn't actually like open or close anything, it's just for shows. Anyways, but I love him because look, he has a little mushroom on his little thing. And I'll see like the colors matching him so good and he's so green and just beautiful. And he had a little, little bit of blush on his nose, which I really like, super cute. This one's one of my favorites. I'm so glad I was able to buy this before it sold out too. So I started shopping super early, which is good because I can get all the good picks. But now I'm going to get into my ornaments. I don't have a, nearly enough ornaments to cover my tree. But that's lots of problem for another day. My first two, I have these cute little potted plants. They're so cute. Now these tags, 
not these ones these are price tags but these like tags right here i had to cut those off because they're literally so annoying and ugly but here are my cute little plants they have a few more different like plant colors um but they didn't match my theme like that but i may have to buy two more because i only have two of these and all these ornaments i'm about to show you right now they're all three dollars a piece so and three dollars adds up pretty quickly but here they are they're so cute i'm obsessed with these next i have this apple which is extremely random to have but yeah i have an apple for my tree and it's cute it's sparkly it's definitely like not giving three dollar quality it's giving dollar tree so this one was a little bit overpriced compared to the rest but you know what i'm not even mad i may also buy another apple honestly just because i feel like it'd be weird to have one single apple oh so i'm gonna have that some more next i have these little gnome dudes some more little gnome dudes what do you wait what do you expect but oh my bad but yeah i have this chocolate one right here this dark chocolate and then i have this white chocolate one right here so super freaking cute they do have a few more i'm gonna be buying like all the different ones they have i think i only have like two more though i'm not gonna buy those though next these two are probably my favorite like some of my favorite things over here but i have these super cute little people these little people ornaments they're so cute this one he's obviously a mailman this one's a gardener she's killing it and look at them aren't they cute i am gonna be buying more people because i do want to incorporate more like brown into my tree so that way it looks super like earthy kind of like a green brown red type of theme um and then there's gonna be like some hints of gold in there also i'm excited lastly for more ornaments which these are the last ones that i have obviously like i said i need to buy more because this is not going to cover a seven foot tree but it's like a pencil tree so it is slimmer anyways it's important but here they are i got these in a four pack they're like four for twelve um and they also sold individually for like three dollars each just like the rest of them but here they are they're so freaking cute i may have to buy another like four pack of these just so that way my tree makes sense but it's so cute a little mushroom vibe i don't know what's with target and like mushrooms this year but mushrooms for christmas i'm actually like living for it all right that's gonna end this haul that's pretty much everything i've gotten so far and that's like a hundred dollars worth of stuff I don't know if it looks like $100 worth of stuff, but it, 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 it was $100 worth of stuff. But everything came in like this huge box, except for my wrapping paper. But everything else came in like this huge box right here. But like they really did the most. So anyways, thank you guys for watching this portion of the video. Adios. Hey guys, Kenny here and welcome to part two of my Christmas decor haul. I'm going to be showing you guys what else I got. And this is the last of the decor. I'm not buying any more decor for my room. I might buy like a throw blanket or maybe a throw pillow or something like that. But I'm pretty much done as far as decor wise go because this year I pretty much started fresh. I mean, I didn't have to buy a tree. I will link everything down below. Can't guarantee that it'll be in stock. I think for the most part it'll be in stock. So yeah, everything's from Target. And let's get into it starting off i got some more clothing boxes um because it wasn't enough and these were three dollars next thing i'm gonna show you guys is something that's not necessarily new but it's something that i'm putting on my tree so yeah i'm putting these like flocked red berries on my tree because i feel like it'll add like a really cute pop of color and you see my vibe this will definitely match my vibe so i'm gonna put these red berries and i have a whole bag of them they're actually my mom's but next up i have ornaments like regular ornaments these ones are actually glass but i like how it has like the shiny and then like the matte ones in there and then these were as you can see they're five dollars for nine of them and i have two boxes um i don't know if this is enough to cover my whole tree but i don't plan on buying another box so hopefully those red berries fill it in a little bit because i'm not buying anything else all right so next i'm going to show you guys what ornaments i have some of them are repeating like i have just bought more of the ones i already had and then some of them are actually newer so first i'm going to show you guys the ones that i already have some of i bought two more of the same plants that i have and all these ornaments i'm about to show you guys are three dollars each but yeah i bought three more i'm at two more of them and then i bought three mushrooms now the other ones i have i bought them in a four pack it was like four for twelve and then these ones i had to buy them individually three dollars each obviously and i didn't buy the fourth one because i was being cheap and i didn't want to spend an extra three dollars so that's probably about three of them but it's fine i feel like it'll be fine anyways and then lastly for the ones that repeat i just got another apple even though it's like definitely overpriced it looks so cheap but at the same time it's cute and i feel like it will make more sense if i had more if that makes sense so yeah now i'm going to show you guys my newer ornament picks starting off with these ones which honestly i have two from the same like theme kind of i don't know what you call it but i have two that are similar to these ones in like the same collection 
so yeah but here they are this one's like short and chocolate and round and this one's tall and thin next i have this one it's just like a bird it's a simple basic one i pretty much just got this one just because of the color the green in it is the green that i actually want and have in my tree so yeah this ornament right here is probably my favorite ornament out of all of them or definitely up there to the top it's this super cute like what is this a squirrel and i like how it's just on like the little sled holding on to it it is so cute and i also really like the tail it's super cute quick intermission because i bought this beanie baby for my job it's a bear and she's so cute her name is cody and her birthday is february the 7th so yeah this is cody guys cody with the k i'll grow up and stop buying these one day but now i feel like i need a whole collection anyways I just have three ornaments left starting off with this one right here i have more people as i mentioned i wanted to get more like a more variety of them so i have this dude right here he's a he's a waiter he's a waiter this next one i have right here she's kind of mm, she's kind of not giving but i have this bartista right here but she looks like an old no offense but she looks like an old her head the stitching looks a little bit weird right there but other than that here she is i said she'll probably be towards the back of my tree just because she's not she's not that cute i'm not even gonna lie and then lastly for my ornaments i have this one right here she's one of my favorites this little mixed girl right here she's a florist and yeah i really like her hair that's probably my favorite part her hair and then like the red and the roses just pops out and like looks super cute to me so this one's one of my favorite ones another thing i picked up was some tape i think i i took one out but this one i got for my job i got this from ross and it was only 3.99 for five of these so highly recommend going there and seeing what they have as far as christmas decor goes and then that's it but another thing that i need to get is some more wrapping paper because i kid you not as you can see i already have trees i mean i already have gifts under my tree and literally four gifts take up a whole row and I knew this, I knew they look skinny, but I was just thinking maybe they're, you know, maybe, but for $5.50 and they only covered four gifts, that's incredibly overpriced. Like, what the heck? Thank you guys so much for watching this haul. Please excuse my bare face. I did not feel like getting ready, but yeah. Anyways, peace out. Follow me in your hand. I'm just a speck of shine.